We're filming a lip dub, which is basically like we're gonna lip sync kind of to a song and it's gonna go all the way through the entire school for a carnival. <laughs> Hi guys, good morning. Today is the day of Punahou Carnival. Punahou Carnival is basically our school's carnival. Wait, wait, hold on, I can't talk with my retainer. Okay, there you go. So basically we raise $2 million every year and it goes to like financial aid and it just like supports our school. So it's like a two day long thing. Today is Friday, February 1st. Oh wow, it's my birthday month! I am excited, I'm turning 17 this month. Yes, okay. Anyways, so I'm a junior and every year the juniors run the carnival and we've been planning it since like last summer. I am the booth chair for a silent auction. It's not what I picked, but it's what they gave me even though I'm not a very silent person, but... So at the carnival they have a lot of rides, food, games, just like a ton and it's all ran by students and parent volunteers so it's a really really big event here in Hawaii I guess like it's probably the event of the weekend at least probably maybe the month because not a lot of schools do this and it's super super exciting well, I will take you guys along with in this vlog and I hope you guys enjoy it it's a little bit of a different style but I will see you when I get ready because I don't look good this is my supposed fit but it is way way too cold today it's like extremely windy and it's just been the coldest Hawaii has been for a really long time for us okay it's like 60s and <laughs> I can't do it because we can't get dropped off inside school today because obviously the campus is full of our carnival stuff. I changed into jeans because I look a little bit more present. Oh my god, oops, I just walked into this. Okay, so here's our campus before everything happens. The grass is really, really nasty because it rained. I left the house in such a rush that I forgot to bring my lip balm and I forgot to wear jewelry on my neck and it kind of upset about that hi so here we are at breakfast now I just changed into this because it's really 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 hot in here and now I imagine that people on the mainland have to struggle with outside being really cold and the inside being heated so then you have to change and it's confusing this is the carnival print that they design and they said it's like japan for someone to make every year this is my dean this is the president of the school this is my other dean this is my donut chocolate chip muffin oh wait what i got banana nut are you kidding me because black coffee is healthy and I'd rather have my sugar, milk, calories, and pastries and stuff. You know when like you're walking with someone and then they find a friend and then you're just here and you're waiting on the side for them and you look really awkward. My hair is really nice and wavy today. That means it dried well so I'm happy. That guy is trying to kick us out of our own booth right now. Wait, so that's really cool. <laughs> he literally called admin right now and he's like, what are your names? Like, are you allowed to be here? And we're like, this is our booth. Like, okay. Like we're literally working like a freaking total of 16 hours and he's trying to kick us out. So. Hi guys. <laughs> our must see table. You can get dermatology sculpture. The good doctor autographed picture and cap, and I'm obsessed with this show. And autographed jersey, round trip tickets, Hawaii Five O studio tour, Los Angeles Chargers ticket, oh, a Porsche wine cooler, Hawaii Five O autographed script. Oh, this is a really cool necklace. Here's all of our signs and stuff. 
stuff. So here are all our rides. This one is my favorite, but last year it got so broken and it wasn't working the whole time. So this is the empty E.K. Fernandez tent before it opens. basically just standing around not doing too much look at how cute they are this is huck giblet fluffy elvis is my favorite i think winston and t-bone someone just bought parking for 650 for two days it looks like the ocean so here's our first food we're literally hiding in the corner so that Everyone over there doesn't see us eating because you're not allowed to. Marvel in full swing. Maddie and I are finally free from our shift for like an hour ish and we can get food because I am still hungry. So bad earlier and it's so good. So now we're going to get some chicken sticks. I feel like teriyaki and ponzu sauce. That's so good. I think I forgot to tell you guys my schedule and I don't know if you can hear me but well basically I worked from like 8 to 5 p.m. and then I can just hang out for the rest of the time because the good thing about our booth is that it ends really early it ends at 8 while other booths end at 11 so I can just chill oh, after that delicious it's like basically a deep-fried donut with powdered sugar over it and it's the best. So I just put $5 in the machine, but I didn't even put my card in the slot, so it didn't register. So I have to go to customer service now. Love that for me. Everyone's just using us for AC at this point. It's fine, <laughs> but I don't blame them. Um, miraculously, I think God set a miracle and it is so hot outside, which is good because it's sunny and people can play and stuff. Second one, I'm going to just give us some grenade gum. Oh my goodness. It's coming out of the... <laughs> Here, I'll do napkins for you guys. No, I can tap it through. Okay. Update. So there's been seventeen thousand dollars made already from silent auction because some people do the buy it now function, so they have to pay like one hundred fifty percent of the value, which is a lot, but it's crazy. Hey guys, so now we got euros. We're not allowed to be eating in here, but Anderson's just full on eating. <laughs> you should at least duck down. You're supposed to sit on the floor to eat. I'm finally free. And I have no work until tomorrow. Me too. Huh? There's a green lot portable. Hey guys, so these two little cutters were trying to cut and I was like, yeah, they're they're trying to go with their friends. I was like, oh hey, I'm in line here. And she's like, I'm gonna go with my friends. And I was like, uh and then I just kept stands there. <laughs> just, he just doesn't move. She just stands there and she's like, coming from Sorry, gotta go. Yeah, I just want to... See this one? Yeah. Okay, ready? Watch the coin. Okay? I'm gonna take one, put it in there. Okay. Okay, ready? One. Oh my god! Okay, open up. Ah! What grade are you guys in? Cool. We're in 11. So, you guys can see the entire carnival below us. I'm so nervous now. Oh my god. Okay guys, that was really fun. Oh my ah, okay, we're getting off now. Oh and that's for our number. They were the ones that were across from us. Kitty. This one's super cool. You kind of go like diagonal. Night vibes. That one got me quite dizzy and yeah. <laughs> Stumbling around a little bit. But that was really cool. You get like stuck to the thing. So even if you try to like get up, like if you try to do a sit up, you physically can't. So the seniors have variety show, so they're performing, and I haven't seen them, and now I see them! Beautiful chicken on the stick again. This guy was like shoving himself in front of me, so he wouldn't let me get in front of him just to get some condiments, even though I'd be standing on the side. So then while I was waiting, a water droplet from the roof fell on it, 
this right into this and that's absolutely disgusting because it was gross it was so <laughs> disgusting because it's it's like metal rusty metal and that's i think that's unsafe How much for the big one? These types of games were my kryptonite. I am proud to say that I don't really play them anymore because I used to be obsessed and I spent way too much money, so now I don't. But sometimes I get so, so tempted. Right after I said that, I played, but I lost to Jessica right here. Wait, I look like an egg. Hey, it's raining today. It's raining and I look like I am missing a part of my head, which I am because I have this hoodie on. I just don't really drink drinks usually, but everyone was getting a drink, so I thought that I would get a drink too. Yeah, she didn't want to be left out. I know, because I am a follower. You know what? I don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's Mr. Raffoon. Do you where? see it? Where? The way that you flip your head. Oh god, I'm stuck. And you smile, the crowd, it ain't hard to tell You don't know, uh, uh. oh god, this keeps happening I haven't updated you guys in a while But um, we were just hanging out, sitting on the floor, kind of blocking people <laughs> But that's okay We had good talks, so yeah, you guys can't be part of that talk, sorry Guys, I'm so tired now What I'm time is it? Thoroughly dead 10.25 It's been a really long day a lot of time on our feet and stuff, so I'm just really done. Good night. See you tomorrow. And my skin has been peeling so bad because it's been really windy out here, so my skin's like crackling. And when I wash my face, I if I use my fingernails and like I scratch it like that to kind of like exfoliate it a little bit, there will be tons of dead skin cells just under my nail it looks like i dug my fingernails into like a bar soap and it has just like residue underneath which is disgusting that might be a little bit tmi but yeah so now i'm gonna change into my outfit it's so freaking cold this weekend i'm upset because like mm, i don't want to have to deal with this weather stuff because my romper is short and it's for summer well it's always kind of summery in hawaii except for these past few weeks i'm just shoved it into jeans i feel like this is a very best dressed thing to do because if i don't know if you guys watch her but i follow her instagram and she shoved her dress in jeans and it looked really good so i thought i'd do that and i feel like it's not bad i just realized that even my jacket smells like the smoke that my hair smelled like and it's disgusting i smell like meat Hey guys, so I just got to Carnival. I look like a mess because my hair is still kind of wet, but I had to put this hood on because it started raining. And I'm carrying this and this and a backpack. I'm working a splat trap at 1 to 1.30, so basically kids are gonna be like pelting like water balloons or things like that at me and like super soakers. And I'm gonna get really wet and it's already really cold and windy, so hopefully I survive and I don't get sick because I would be really upset if I got sick right now and I got Starbucks even though I never drink Starbucks but we are just I need it today you know and extra shot caffeine because we need to stay excited and happy and awake so yeah that's where I'm at um, so I got the iced caramel macchiato with an extra shot and extra caramel which is not very healthy but Hey guys, I'm with Hi, Ethan. Kaylee Kate Vlogs, follow me. This is my biggest fan and supporter. So I'm on the way to Splat Trap. I have my outfit on. I look disgusting. And I don't have slippers, so I have my shoes on, but I'm gonna probably have to go barefoot, which is gross. But. So um, Chris and Taylor are in there, so I don't need to go anymore. Which I'm very relieved because I was not feeling well at all, and this is a weight lifted off my shoulders. Okay, so our music and computer is stopped projecting. So. Hi, we fixed the projectors. Now we're gonna go eat. That's so right outside. Here I have another two chicken sticks 
and a burger, and they're my favorite carnival foods. What are you eating? Gyro, gyro, what's it called? It's a gyro. A <laughs> gyro. Why is there a G then? The G is silent because some languages are fancy like that. They just sell a bunch of random stuff. Oh my goodness, this is so cute. So everyone's basically like thrifting right now. This is kind of cool. Look at this cool thing. I feel like it could be cute, but I wouldn't actually have the effort to do something with it. My third malasada. It is so sunny now. I'm itchy. My face is itchy. Oh my hey god, guys. I'm in Kaylee Vlogs. Hey vlog, how's it going? We just got ice cream. 15 minutes. A lot of stuff sold already, but we have still some stuff for bids. So everyone has picked up their stuff and we're kind of gonna clean up soon, I think. And our booth ends at 8 luckily, so we have like four hours, three to four hours to kill before we have our last like parade around carnival. Back with more chicken sticks. This time they gave me two again. So we're kind of just sitting around, not really doing much, but. <laughs> hey guys, um, what's it called? What is it? 40 seconds left until the last time I ever work at carnival. So excited because next year's variety show, so we're not working ever again, and my feet will not have to endure this pain unless I'm like in Disneyland or at a concert or something. We're so relieved. Okay, so at 8 20, we're supposed to have a flash mob, which is like a surprise dance thing that we have for all the juniors, but I'm not really sure how it's gonna turn out. But we're all at the sound booth now, but there's like only like 10 people, so yeah. Guys, it's starting. Everyone's just like standing there. This is Why is there really 20 people out of the 400 people in our grade here? Like, where is everyone? Over here. Oh my God. We are at Portuguese bean soup. If you remember my vlog from last year, this is like really crazy. This is the Portuguese bean soup. It is world famous. It doesn't look too cute, but it tastes good. Hi, we're ready to ball it up over here in basketball. I just need to use up my scripts. Guys, I can't believe I just made two. I'm so proud of myself. Guys, I'm in the sound booth right now and I feel kind of cool. This is Rachel trying to be the vlog. She's the reason why I'm at the sound booth, which is really cool. I've never been in here before. And it's probably the only time I'll ever be in here. Look who I found! Got two more chicken sticks. I used up all my script on this, so that's probably gonna be the last thing of 2019. Okay, we're gonna have to say bye to this one because I am so full that I'm gonna throw up if I keep eating and that's not cute, so yeah. Seizure time. Guys, Alex and I were out here sitting against a pillar just chatting, but our entire class was doing this. I just found this on the floor. Guys, we just made the parade, look. Face by a ball, no, I'm kind of hurt. Kicked. I got kicked. Oh my oh. god, somebody hit me again! Wow! Is this a bug? Yeah. So I just got in the car. I'm going home now and I'm probably gonna end the vlog here So I hope you enjoyed it if you did don't forget to give it a like comment down below your favorite part of the vlog and If you liked 
me or you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and join the family. And give me five stars on Uber. Yeah, this is my Uber driver right here. And I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. Oh, I also forgot to say that you should follow me on Instagram to see my carnival pics and stay updated with me. It feels really weird that carnival is over now because I feel like we were looking forward to it for so long and we've been planning for it for so long and now it's just over and I don't know, it's kind of a weird feeling. Good night, I hope you enjoy and have a good day. Bye.